So I think they'd enjoy getting to know each other better. I think it's a nice idea, but shouldn't I do it for once? I always seem to be taking luncheon off you. No, I'd rather. You see, Mrs Potter likes to have people to cook for. And Spratt needs something to occupy his mind. Oh? We both have an inkling that my maid Collins is on the way out. Oh, I do hope not. No, I don't, I don't mean she's dying. I mean, she's on her way out of my house. She keeps talking about her mother being infirm. But I'm infirm. Why doesn't she think about that? You're as infirm as Windsor Castle. And why does Spratt mind particularly? Because he likes things to be just so. But also, I think Collins was his creature and does his bidding, you know, without qualm or query. He can't be sure of that in the next one. Well, never having had a lady's maid, it's not a challenge I've had to tussle with. Mm. But you'll come on Thursday? I will. I think it would be nice for Dr Clarkson to see beyond Lord Merton's position and get to know the man. Mm, I agree. Oh, I knew I had something to tell you. Shrimpy thinks he may be on the trail of Princess Curagi. Oh, I am pleased. Yes, he's heard a rumour of some Russian nurses working in one one Chai. And that's in Hong Kong? Well, nearby, I think. Well, if it's true, it sounds much better than it might have been. Yes, the idea of Princess Sabina scrubbing the sick and emptying bedpans is a cheering one. Will you tell her husband? No, I'll wait until Shrimpy is certain. These things must be managed carefully. Yes. Sounds as if this must be managed very carefully. <laughs>